Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to do SEO for GoDaddy websites in 2024. So today we're going to learn how to optimize your GoDaddy website for search engines or search engine optimization. Of course, SEO is crucial for increasing your website's visibility and driving more traffic. So follow this step-by-step -step guide to boost your site's SEO in 2024 and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you will need to go and open a browser. For me here, I'm using Brave. For you, you can use whatever you want. You'll need, first of all, to go and access your GoDaddy website. So go to the URL section, just type godaddy.com, uh, log in into your account. If you have an account, if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create a new one. For me, I'm already logged in, so I'll find my username here. For you, you'll find the sign-on option here if it's your first time. Click on it to log in into your account. If you don't have an account, click on it and you'll find the bottom sign up to create a new account. You can use Google, uh, Microsoft, and I guess like Facebook to, uh, if you don't want to get through all the bonus steps of creating or even logging in into your account. So once you're logged in, you'll find yourself here. Make sure to go and click on your username in my product or in here, of course, you'll find all the websites that you have. If you don't have any websites, make sure first of all to create a new one. Uh, like, you don't have to do basically anything. You just have to answer, answer some questions that will be asked and they will create a website for you. Of course, if you don't know, like, or if you still need some guidance, I've made a lot of videos about that. You can go and check it out. So once you have your websites, it's time, as we said, to do some SEO for it or boost the SEO of it. Why? Or first of all, why? Uh, what is SEO? So as an example, if I go here and open a new tab and uh, type as an example, I don't know, just type time. And the enter button. So once I click on time, as an example, and scroll down, so I find here some results. This is the first one, the second one, third, fourth, and etc. Let's say, an example, this will be as an example here my website. I don't want my website to appear here. I want my website to appear in the top of the page. Why? Because if I, it appears on the top of the page, People will click on my website a lot and will get into it if they type the relevant keywords. So basically, how to do that, how to make it uh, appear in the top by basically boosting the SEO or search engine ranking. So how can you do that? First, we'll have to start by researching some keywords. Start by researching like some relevant keywords for your website. You can use tools like uh, there's Google Keyword Planner, SEM Rush. Or even H, uh, I guess no, A H refs to find some keywords that you target or your targeted audience uh, is searching for. As an example, on your website, make sure to focus on keywords with a good balance of search volume and competition, and make a list of primary and secondary keywords to target your site. I'll just show you some examples on Google keyword example planner. Here, I'll just go and click on that. So go to Keyword Planner, add example. And here's an example. You'll be able to get search volume and forecast and even discover some new uh, keywords. Example, you'll have first of all to enter the products or service closely related to your business. As an example, let's say gaming. Of course, you can change language. Like for me, I'll just do here English. You can even enter a site to filter unrelated keywords and then click on search results. Here you'll find all the keywords that is related, for example, to gaming, etc. You'll find every information about it. So make sure to keep that in mind. Now, once you find and have a list for you of a primary and secondary keywords to target on your site. And of course, as an example, let's say this uh, website, why not? I want to improve or boost the SEO of this site. Let's say that. So how can we do that? Simply, if you want to optimize your website's content, if you want to optimize your SEO, other than researching some keywords, you'll need to optimize your website's content. You'll need to go, first of all, just go and edit website, get into the website builder, and make sure to incorporate, first of all, the keywords that you obtain into your website's content naturally. Ensure that your page titles, uh, heading, uh, maybe even some meta descriptions, and even body contents include your targeted keywords, which is like an example gaming. Make sure to avoid some keywords uh, stuffing 
instead focus on creating some high quality informative content that provide value to your visitors ensure also that your website has a clear logical structure and use a well-organized menu and create some internal links between related pages this helps search engines understand the hierarchy of your content and makes it easier for visitors to navigate to your site and you can create of course a sitemap and submit it to google search console if you want to make sure to also if you have like a lot of images in media optimize the images and other media files on your website use some descriptive files names and alt uh, text that includes your target keywords compress the images to improve the page load time which is crucial factor for seo of course tools like tiny png uh, image optim can help with the image compression make sure also to enhance the mobile friendliness a lot of people just finish their website or uh, like customize their website for just the pc users they completely forgot about the mobile users and there are a lot of people that are using just their phone to check out the websites make sure to do so and enhance your sites for also the mobile users also make sure to enhance the more uh, the like site speed uh, optimize your website loading uh, speed fast loading sites provide a better user experience and rank higher in search results you can use tools like uh, google's page sp uh, speed insight to identify areas of improvement consider even using as example like some content delivery network cdn enabling browser caching and even minimizing like the use of heavy script make sure to also build some backlinks if you know how to and of course you'll need to monitor and analyze the SEO, the SEO performance while you're doing those changes. And as an example, I'll just go here back to dashboard. If you don't know, uh, like if you do have no, you have no knowledge about SEO, and you don't even wanna like learn about all of that, there is, I guess, something here. Let me just go and check with you. So yeah, if you go to marketing on dashboard, click on SEO. There is, I guess, a plan that you can pay. You'll have to simply start uh, seal the spotlight, as you can see, with SEO. So it's, as you can see here, so it uh, will be below and they will take it to the top. So basically you'll have to give them a call and they will do everything for you. You don't even need like uh, to have some SEO knowledge required and you'll be able even to track your ranking also. So that's going to be it for me today. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.